Hello, and welcome back to the future. Tim here, we are playing some more Deus Ex. I have to enunciate that because if I say it too fast, it sounds like gay sex. Welcome back to gay sex. Deus Ex. Isn't it a bit early to toss him back into the trenches? I hear he's almost full. Hey, let's go. Oh man, look at this. I didn't oh. think we'd see you for another six months, no matter what Seraph said. Take my eyeballs. Why is David keeping the SWAT team from going in right away? Doesn't he remember the last attack? Jensen, I knew the boss had an ace up his sleeve. Good to yeah. have you back. I think you up. Why is David keeping the SWAT team from going in right away? Jensen? Jenkins? Wow. I mean, uh, Sarah spared no expense putting you back together, I guess. Nice to see you looking so... Ah, uh, you don't get a lock. About time. You. What happened? You get stuck in an air duct on the way over? Yeah, nice to see you too, Francis. Something's wrong with my retinal display. Can you fix it? If it's what I think it is, probably. Of course, it might seem. Oh, looks like your left and right imaging processors weren't completely in sync. But don't worry, your sentinel health implant will kick in soon, repairing any damage that might have caused. Your retinal Thanks. display should be fine now. Its recognition software won't be picking up hostiles yet, but you should be seeing radar and targeting reticules. Biomedical data too, if you're in pain. Right. We done here? Because Seraph is waiting for me at the helipad. I know. Radicals have broken into our manufacturing plant and taken hostages. Maybe this time you'll actually save people. You know what, motherfucker? If you got a problem with me, Pritchard, why don't you just say it and get it over with? Why no, Jensen? I don't have a problem with you. If anything, I blame myself. The mighty preacher Probably blaming full. himself. <laughs> That's gotta be a first. I'm the one who told Sarif we needed a physical security team to protect us. If he'd read my report closely enough. Wait a second. Are you saying it was your idea to hire me? Not you, Jensen. I wanted Dynacore, Sharp Edge, or Bell Tower. All the top private security contractors were on my list, but Sarif wanted somebody in-house. And so did Dr. Reed. I suggest you leave Megan really out of this. Why, Jensen? It's no secret how close the two of you were. And let's face it, you'd just been fired from SWAT for that massacre in Mexican town. No one was about to hire you. You really have to stop getting your news from those Pikes blogs, Francis. They only confuse you. The point is, if Sarif had listened to me, we wouldn't be having this conversation. But Megan, God love her, always did have Sarif's ear. Seraph's here is going to be hearing a report about violence in the workplace if you keep this up. Uh, you really feel like continuing? Point taken. <laughs> I'll crush your head. Yeah, that's cute. Yeah. Really, you? God, whatever's going on at the factory must be serious. Damn purists. Of course, I heard it. Under attack again? I'm getting the feeling someone has it in for this company. Bye. Didn't Graham just. Security guy. Can you believe that? He should still be in hospital. Yeah, as soon as I can. Pain pills. Just awesome. Be a shame. I'll keep you up to date. Attention, Ellen Marshfield. There is a patent waiting for the reception. Ellen Marshfield is a patent waiting for the reception. Perfect. Please go to the elevator. Adam, how close are you to the helipad? Almost there. Good. Because SWAT's about to turn this into a PR nightmare. Meet me in the chopper. I'll brief you as we go. Workers have been taken hostage, and the entire city holds its collective breath. I doubt I need to remind you folks that this is the second contracts we lost because of the last. Do I need to eat? And the Washington hearings. It is some type of bio paste that I should get to my face. Oh, oh. 
Welcome back, Jensen. Thanks. Didn't think we'd see you around here for a while yet. You know how it goes, Stupid. Malik. Duty calls. Don't I know it. I was in my wingsuit halfway to the top of the Renaissance Center when I got the 911. But you? Six months is a hell of a short time to come back from the dead. You sure you're ready for this? Only one way Sorry. to find out. Roger that. The boss is already on board, arguing with the DPD's tactical response team. They've got the plant surrounded, but Mr. Seraph wants you to go in first. Are you all set here? Because the sooner we take off, the better it will be for everyone. I'm ready. Great. Then let's get airborne. Ghost in the Shell game. But whatever. I told Farida to put us down on a roof. I don't want the crowd seeing you go in. Fine. As long as she pulls you out the minute I'm gone. So what am I looking at here? Who are these guys? <clears throat> Pro-human purists, or so they say. The same purists who've been firebombing limb clinics all over the country. You buy that? No, I don't think it's a coincidence they hit us today, only hours after we moved the Typhoon in for assembly line factory. The Typhoon? Megan's team was testing it the day that bastard... Who's on point for these guys? Adam. I know you and Megan were once... Who is on point for these guys? Yes. Goes by the name of Sanders. That's him, there. He's an augmented Adam. So he can't be one of the mercs who attacked us. But he did know exactly how to get inside our plant. All right. So how do you want me to handle this? First priority is the Typhoon. I'm keeping SWAT out until you've secured it. As far as rules of engagement go, I'll defer to you. Lethal or non-lethal? I'm not looking to start a firefight in there. Just neutralize them. Okay. But just make sure those bastards don't wake up and warn their friends. You remember what it's like in there? A lot of tight enclosed hallways. But the labs themselves are pretty open. High ceilings. So, do you want something you can use from a distance? Or up close? So many options. Probably... Give me something with distance. If I get too close, I'll take them out personally. Just try not to break anything expensive. The Typhoon should be in the factoring labs, but Pritchard will tell you more as you go in. I've got him running comms. Terrific. Anything else? Keep your eyes open for hostages. Free them if you can, but the Typhoon is your number one priority. We developed it for the Alphabet agencies, and if we don't deliver it to them intact and still a secret, well, I'm sure you'll get the job done right. Special delivery. Nope. Oh. Yeah. That's one. That's Reggie. 
about fucking time. You know there are hostages in there, right? Tell me you're the guy we've been twiddling our thumbs waiting for. SI Security. Name's Jensen. Jensen. Yeah. I thought I recognized you. Used to be on Team 2 till that Mexican town thing went down. I gotta say, you're the last person I pictured taking orders from a CEO. Things change. Not always for the better. Feel like getting in there and doing whatever it is your boss wants you to do? Because maybe then we can do our job. You look pretty dug in up here. What's the react team plan? We got Alpha's point and Bravo is wing, boat standing by to breach the target. We're coordinating from here, but until your boss gives us the go-ahead, we're just holding our dicks. Realistically, Maybe how much time do I have before any shooting starts? According to protocol, none. According to your lawyers, the sooner you get in there, the sooner we can hose this powder keg down and call it a day. We've got people inside. Any idea where I should look for them? Yeah. Your plant manager, Josie Thorpe, managed to slip a call out before someone snatched her cell. She said the hostages are being held in an office near the assembly labs. Makes sense. The workers were setting up for a production run, so they'd have been concentrated there. You know more about that than I would. Anything else? Yeah. Intel on these purists. How much you got? How much you want? Damn it. How many am I looking at down there? Hard to say. We spotted three in the courtyard, maybe half a dozen inside. But that's a sketchy estimate at best, since we seem to be getting a loop playback off your intellicams. That shouldn't be possible. I told Seraph to make sure Pritchard overhauled the system. Well, someone inside must be tech savvy, because all we're seeing is a loop. For all we know, there could be five, ten, or three dozen perps in there. The leader's name is Sanders, right? What's his story? Zeke Sanders. We're running background on him now. Looks like he fought two tours in the Gulf. One of them on a recycle military bill. You mean he's augmented? Seraph told me he's not. He used to be augmented. Says his augs made him do evil shit, so he ripped him out. Now he's got a whole crew of gullible street kids listening to his crap and ready to die for him. Or kill. Cool. They communicate any demands yet? Not yet, but I get the feeling they're not that organized. Most of the guys I've seen look like street bangers and thugs. The kind who get their jollies trashing equipment. You ask me, it's the man in charge you have to worry about. I think I've heard enough. You sure? Wouldn't want to make your boss unhappy. Shut up. God damn it. I got it from here. Quit. Sit tight. Wait for Seraph's signal. Like we got a choice. Alright guys, next time on Lunar Screens, I breach the building, I kill people. Well, actually, 